when they try to move in, you know what you must do, right? Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. Opening day baseball on the show. It's the Springfield Cardinals taking on the San Antonio Missions. First pitch coming your way next. Just about ready to go. And starting this one is Maxwell Peters. He goes deep in the ball game, so the bullpen, who's been a little overused lately, they might get a rest if he does what he normally does today. So just about set. And now the shortstop, Cleveland Baker. Leading off for Springfield. The shortstop, Cleveland Baker. The pitch. Hey. Edge of the zone for a strike, and a new season is officially underway. First pitch, six o'clock. And a pitch. Foul ball. Oh, and two now. I got count one and two. Rarely will you see a pitcher just to waste a pitch like that. The batter wasn't even tempted to swing. Every pitch needs to have a purpose so that it can set up a following pitch to help you get that out.
And now it's even up. Out towards left center. Makes the catch. One up, one down. Batting second. The left fielder. Mark Kane. And the batter now, Mark Kane. Peters back to work. That one ripped. And out of here. That one felt good, and it gives him the lead in the first. It's 1-0. Now, Boo, clearly some frustration out there on the mound right now. I mean, that ball was so close to going foul. Would have been a long strike, but instead... Batter gets rewarded. Did a nice job of getting to the pitch and hitting it hard that enough to get over the fence. The right fielder. And now Javier Feliz. The next offering misses. Ball two. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. 2-0. Chopped out in front of the plate. Tosses the first, and that is out number two. Batting four, the third baseman, Jimmy Warner. Two outs, base is empty. And here is Jimmy Warner. The pitch. That one missed. And fires in a fastball at 95. The high fastball, particularly for young hitters, can be hard to lay off of because you see it so well at eye level, but it's really hard to catch up and get that top hand to work on time. Next offering is foul back. Two down, nobody on. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. Third out, that ends the frame. One in the inning, and it comes from a rather unlikely power source. It's an early 1-0 lead. Showing the slab in today's game, number 13. Well, that 12 to 6 curveball explodes out of the hand. And because he's able to throw the high fastball at the top of the strike zone for a strike, hitters commit to that pitch. And before they know it, they're swinging over the top of that curveball. We go to the bottom of the first, leading off Carlton Little. You know, this guy's great speed is in the back of that pitcher's mind. If he can get on, it's going to give him one more thing he's got to think about. First offering misses the mark. The one one fouled off left side. On the ground, right side. And that one finds its way through. Just one of those seen eye base hits through the infield. It just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you a knock. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Now the number two hitter, Lou Castilla. And he deals. On the corner for a strike, and that is strike one. Little gets his lead at first with nobody out. Hey. 
Next offering is in for a strike. With two strikes, may see some movement over there at first base, trying to stay out of a double play here. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Well, that event seemed to be over as soon as it started. Three-pitch strikeout. You've got to be better at the plate right there, at least to foul something off, extend that at bat. Joaquin Ryan, the next to hit. And the pitch. And there's something you don't see very much in today's game, the pitch out. Next one misses, and it's 2-0. Oh. Good speed on the base pass. He handles the bat very well. I wouldn't be surprised if the skipper puts on some type of hit and run or run and hit. And the righty deals. 3-1, and he couldn't come up with it. So here we go again with the walks. It's been a real struggle finding the zone for him in the past. Now, even if they get out of this jam, these walks add pressure and stress to the entire team. Andreas Espinosa takes a strike there as he stands at the plate now. Right-hander kicks, deals. Strike two. I understand you want to try to gauge that guy's fastball, but you also have to be aggressive and ready to hit in your zone. Now you're in a tough spot. And the next pitch is way outside. Runners at first and second with one gone. The next pitch misses. Two and two. See how the catcher wanted that pitch up and in. Want to try to tie him up. That's the one thing we're seeing. That high fastball, you have to get it up there because of how hitters have changed their swings. 3 2 now. Got him. That's his second strikeout. Well, you got to be ready to swing the bat with a runner in scoring position in two strikes. That Just put the ball in place right somewhere, field. and you got a chance. Very frustrating for him, I'm sure. See if the next guy can pick him up. Matt Geringer now at the plate. Here comes a pitch. And takes low for ball one. Swing and a miss. And it's one and one. Next offering is fouled back. Well, lots of pitches thrown in this first inning. It's kind of that nightmare scenario for starting pitching. But you know what? It's still early enough. He can settle in. He can get some length if he just cleans up his mechanics a little bit. Righty to the plate. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And that is the third out of the inning. All set for the start of the inning. And now the center fielder, Garrett Guerra. For Springfield, the center fielder, Garrett Guerra. And a pitch. And a good fastball to start him off at strike one. Swing and a bouncer, and he can't come up with it. To first, and he just gets it there in time. One away. Good late bite on that slider. Got the hitter out in front, rolled over on it. Exactly what it was supposed to do. Marco Ferreira getting ready to hit. The wind of the pitch. Ball one there. Next pitch is outside. Pretty easy to give up on that pitch right there. Started on the edge of the plate with the spin. You know it's going to finish well off the plate. And a foul ball makes the count two and one. Line drive, but that's a foul ball. 
to two now. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Next pitch misses. And that's ball three. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. And he walked him. What a battle. It's not always easy laying off a 3-2 pitch. And I tell you what, he earned that walk. Now it's going to be Hiroki Yabu. That hits the dirt. 1-0. Ferreira over at first with one away. Righty delivers. Nope. That one off the mark, and it's two and one. Next offering misses, and that's ball three. Recognize that changeup right out of the hand. Just spit on it. Payoff pitch. Got him looking. And two away now. Well, definitely a borderline pitch right there, and he didn't look too convinced as he headed back to the Bad dugout. Game. You know, those are tough ones to let go as a hitter, but with the human umpire calling balls and strikes, it's always going to be on you to protect yourself with two strikes. Here's your one. On the corner for a strike. That's strike two. At the belt and fires. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. We played an inning and a half. It's one nothing. And welcome back. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Now it's the DH, Richard Sanchez. The pitch. He needs a quick one, two, three this time around. Last inning through a lot of pitches. The wind of the pitch. And there's the strike. Well, we call that key holding. Even though it's right there and looks pretty good, if he doesn't love it, he's not going to swing that early in the count. Next offering is foul back. Here's a one-two. That misses. It's two and two. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. And that's the first out. Came inside with that two-strike fastball nicely and just bunched that him up that. on the inside the part of the field. plate. Couldn't get around Good. on it and catch it out oh, front. Man. Many times if you do, it's a foul ball. And you know a lot of pitchers, they really don't like working inside with two strikes. Because they do not want to hit that batter. And when they've got him up against the ropes, got to figure out a way to put him away. Did a nice job right there. Billy Perez stands in now and lets that one go for a strike. A swing and a soft liner. Acevedo gets under it. He makes the grab. And there are two outs. Batting eight. The catcher. Two outs, bases empty. And here's the catcher, Scott Love. And Chris, 
his big strength is defense. But it is interesting, in today's world of baseball, compared to when you played, a good defensive catcher is considered differently. Whatever you get offensively is a bonus, but he's got to put the fingers down. He's got to present pitches to the umpire. They're going to help his pitcher get more strikes. Here's a 1-1. One -one. Line drive, base hit. Batting done. So digging in, Travis Pineda. The pitch. That's in there. It's 0-1. Love leads off first with two down to the inning. Next offering is in for a strike. Perhaps not quite ready to hit. First two pitches by him for a couple of strikes. Now back is against the wall. He's going to have to figure something out and figure it out quickly. In the dirt. Runner holds. Count goes to one and two. And now it's one and two. Stays alive. Kicks and deals. And it's even up. And he chases that one. And that's the inning. Welcome back. Top half of the third inning. Now it's the second baseman, Antonio Acevedo. Antonio. Acevedo. Yeah, the right hater back to work. There's a strike. There it was. Oh, oh, here it is. Hit it. He gets a take, gets a head and a count. And yeah, the right hander deals. Swing and a miss. No balls, two strikes. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And one away. So up next, now Cleveland Baker. Cleveland Baker. The wind of the pitch. And first offering is fouled off. The pitch. Ball. One oh. Yeah, now two balls and a strike. Out towards right center field. And he can't make the play. And he'll pull into second safely. Now batting. Left field. Mark Kane. Mark Kane digs in. Now. And a pitch. One out and a runner at second. Oh, and two as he waves at that one. Well, you got the hitter already chasing that nasty slider. If you're on the mound, you just want to expand the zone right now. Get a swing and miss and get through this at bat. And that one hit to first. Next offering upstairs. Pretty standard high 0-2 fastball right there. If you're smart, go look for something down in the zone, but not too far. Don't want to chase that breaking ball in the dirt. And a foul ball, he stays alive. 
Runner at second here, one gone. Next one misses. Two balls, two, two balls, strikes. Two strikes. Stays alive. Kicks and fires. And down on strikes. Two gone now. So two down now. And here is Javier Feliz. The right-hander back to work. And that one just misses a ball and no strikes. Left-hand batter waits. So two balls and no strikes. Well, no need to go right at this guy. First base is open. He can hurt you. So make him expand his zone. If he doesn't, give him a walk. And here it comes. Good eye right there. Appears they're working around him with the base open, Singy. Well, you know these 2-0 counts, Boo. They're just not what they used to be. And we sound like old guys when I say that. But... Ultimately, this is a strategic game, and you expect to see this type of approach by the pitcher in this situation. Now front pulls that one foul. Now it's three and two. And a pitch. Hard hit, left field, base hit. Here comes the runner. And that's going to get into the corner. Run comes in from second, and they take a two-run lead. It's an RBI double, and it's 2-0. Now that is third base. Jimmy Warner. Jimmy Warner will hit next. He's 0 for 1. And a pitch. Good eye in that spot. Runner leads away at second. Way high. And the strategy of winning a ball game, when you can make that pitcher work a little more, expose himself by throwing pitches, that could be the key to winning perhaps later on. So good job of extending this inning, getting a knock with two outs to bring the number four hole hitter up. The pitch. Fought off foul. Next offering is foul back. And that one fouled off. Next offering misses down and away. That one ripped left field. It one hops off the wall. Should be extra bases. Throw and it gets away. Throw is wide. He's off the bag. Run scores, and this inning continues. The center field. That's a good sound coming off the bat, man. And as he connected out front and ripped it into the outfield, that's one of those swings where you just don't even feel the ball hit the barrel. That's a pure stroke. Guerra looks at a ball as he stands in for the second time. Now time is called here. Pitching coach on his way out to the mound. Right-hander kicks, deals, popped up. Castilla makes the catch, and that'll do it. 
as we go to the last of the third. And now, Carl Little. The missions in striking distance, but have some work to do. Boog, it starts with the leadoff, man. Need a good at bat out of him right here. Hit hard on the ground is short. The throw to first. One gone, bottom of the third inning. The batter, number 13. Second baseman. Next to hit, Lou Castilla. He was a strikeout victim his first time. A wide to kick the pitch. In the air, left field. Kane on the move towards the line. Makes the grab. Two away down. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there. That front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other way with some authority instead of a fly out to left. And he deals. And first offering is fouled off. Up the middle. The third baseman, number six, Andreas. So two down, down the third baseman, Andreas Espinosa. Here comes a pitch. There's the strike. Righty to the plate. Now one and one. Soft contact in the air. Feliz coming in on it. That gets down for a hit. Cut off, throw to third. Espinosa into second, and he's got a double. Back-to-back -back base hits. When you pop a ball right up field. like that, Number you two. don't expect it to get you a knock too often. But there right there, go. somehow he got it to drop in behind first base, and that's where no one could get to it. And you can feel this crowd waking up a bit here as the guys are starting to make some noise with their bats. Now at the plate, Matt Geringer. First offering misses badly for ball one. The next pitch misses. Now 2 0. Oh. Two 0. Oh. And a strike in there. Ryan at third. Espinosa on at second with two down. Next pitch is outside. The 3 2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Man, that's a tough one to take on the full count, but I guess he saw it really well. It's a really nice plate appearance. And here is Richard Sanchez. First pitch, and he just misses. Base is loaded, two down. And he hits a ground ball right side. He takes it himself to the bag, and that'll do it. Huge opportunity missed there. Back here at the ballpark, and now the DH, Marco Ferreira. The designated hitter, Marco Ferreira. The wind of the pitch. To third, Espinosa handles. Leadoff hitter retired in the fourth. Now batting the first baseman, Hiroki Yabu. Hiroki Yabu now at the plate.
the pitch. There's a strike. Next one is off the plate, and the count is one and one. And a foul ball. One, two now. Oh, he hit him. And that got him pretty flush. He had two strikes on him, and he hit him. Well, it's now safe to say he won't be getting definitely. invited to the charity golf Edmundo. tournament this offseason. Peters back to work. Here comes the pitch. There goes the runner from first. Pulls up, and it drops for a hit. And no thought of testing that arm in right. Despite the runner moving on the pitch, it's now first and second. Didn't take long to get a result for that at bat. But the way defenders track down balls these days, I mean, both from the infield and in the outfield, there really aren't a lot of base hits on balls hit like that. But there's always a little room back behind the first and second baseman to drop a lawn dart in there, and he found a way. Acevedo comes up empty with a swing there. Batting here with one away. And the righty deals. Foul ball there. One out. Runners at first and second. Just a slow ground ball this time. Got the out. Deceptive slider right there. Stayed in the tunnel a long time. Got that hitter out front. Rolled over it. Put it on now the ground. If he can get through this zero. one. Put up a zero. This will help in his outings to come. Now, Cleveland Baker, one for two. The pitch. Well, he's so good about trying to drive the ball to the opposite field gap in these situations. If he takes that approach, he could bust this game wide open. Belton fires. Nope, up there. Boog, I'm not sure how he took that right there. I mean, that was an incredible two strike pitch. Two on, two outs. Swing and a miss, and that is that. I think the key is arm action on the changeup. When you can sell it like a fastball, you drop the velocity, you get the swing and miss, and you walk off the field. And welcome back. Bottom four. Here's the center fielder, Leading Billy Perez. San Antonio, the center fielder, Billy Perez. And the right hander back to work. Ah. All ones the count. And now the count is even. Swings and misses. One ball, two now one and two. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. One down. And now Scott Love. This is a guy who's in the lineup first and foremost because of what he contributes defensively, Chris. And when you talk about preventing runs from being scored, this guy is a big contributor. Next offering way off the plate. I was always told it's hard to take you off the field when you play really good defense, especially at a premier position, and that's what he does. On the ground to the left. One down, base is empty. Puts it in the air out towards left center. Kane under it. He's got it. There's two away. Now batting, shortstop, Travis. So digging in, Pineda. Travis Pineda. This is a guy you got to keep an eye on when he digs in. Definitely been known to drop a drag bunt from time to time, and he's pretty good at it, Chris. 
Yeah, and he creates a, a sense of urgency for the defense because of the speed, because of the ability to put down that bond. And a good fastball strike one. Now you see even sluggers from time to time try and use the bunt really as a way to beat the shift. So a foul ball makes it one and two. Next pitch in the dirt. Now two and two. The punch out there picks up strikeout number seven. Leading off for Springfield. The left fielder. Now the left fielder, Mark Kane. He had a big swing for these guys way back to the first inning. Yeah, Boogie didn't waste any time in this one. The solo shot really got his team going, and he's looking for more right here. The wind and the pitch. That one finds the zone. That's strike one. Next offering is foul back. Field two. And a foul ball. He stays alive. The fastball at the bottom of the zone can be very effective. Just got to keep it on the corners. Next pitch is outside, and it's one and two. Out to short. And he beats it. That's a hit. Great try there. Oh, that's a really tough play no matter who you are, but I think he has a chance to get him at first if he's just able to get that throw off a little quicker. It looked like he took one extra step to set himself and get a grip on the ball. And now the right fielder, Javier Feliz. The pitch. Ball one, no strikes. Checks over to first, back safely. Kane gets his lead at first, nobody out. There's the swing and a miss. Kicks and deals. Hit hard, base hit. Throw back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. A couple of hits in a row for him here. Textbook back control right there. Got a pitch on the outside, saw it deep into the zone, and just barreled it up, went the other way for the knock. Here comes the skipper out of the dugout, and he's ready to make the move. Maxwell Peters won't go any further, and as he heads off, we'll step aside for a minute. Back with the new pitcher after this break. So they turn things over to the righty, Sean Getz. And his job is to collect quick outs and keep his team within striking distance. Well, at this point in the ball game, we're talking about middle innings, and he made a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. Warner lets that one go for a strike. Third trip to the plate for him here. The 0 1 is outside, and it's a ball and a strike. Not the easiest thing. When you're talking about a guy that's, you know, perhaps is going to be in the rotation, you know, maybe a long relief guy to not start an inning, to come into an inning with pressure on it and, and try to get yourself comfortable. One and two now. On the ground right side. Four, six, three. And they turn the double play. Well, the reliever comes in, takes care of that inherited runner, gets that ground ball now double play, and the now he can work on one more guy to Gera. get back in the dugout. Gera. So up next, Garrett Guerra. And here it comes. 
Called strike right there. Filling up the strike zone hasn't been the problem so far. It's the quality of the strikes. That's been the real issue. And you look at the first inning, that's what we saw. Too many pitches out over the plate. Next pitch inside, two and one. Next one off the plate inside, and now three and one. Runner at third, two away. Hammered, base hit. In comes the run from third, and they lead by four. But when you fall behind in the count, you've got to come into the zone, and then guys have a better chance of hitting the ball hard like he did right there. Runner at first with two away. And next is the designated hitter, Marco Ferreira. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Runner on the goal. Throw to second. Out there. And the inning is over. Well, trying to get in the scoring position, but a great catch and throw to end the inning. That's the way to pick up the pitcher. Welcome back. And stepping in is the speedy Carlton Little. The left fielder, Carlton Little. The pitch. There's a strike. Not what he's looking for there in the 0-0 count. Looks like he wants the ball down in the zone. Tap to first. Tosses to the pitcher covering the bag. Pitcher gets to the bag for the out. The batter, number 13. Second baseman, Lou Castilla. Here's the second baseman, Lou Castilla. And a pitch. The 1-0. Nope. And downstairs. Two balls, no strike. And that one missing low. There's a strike. Three balls and a strike. Bounced up the middle. Acevedo handles the chance. Fires over to first. Two up, two down. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. And here's the first baseman, Joaquin Ryan. And a pitch. You'll one. In the air to left center, Baker sizing this one up. No trouble here, puts it away for the out. That is the inning. Leading off for Springfield, the designated hitter, Marco Herrera. And a pitch. On the ground. Fires to first on the run. And that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the sixth. Next to switch hitting first baseman, Hiroki Yabu. The right-hander back to work. In the air, left side, Little. Makes his way towards it. Makes a nice run and catch. Two down. Now batting. Catcher. Edmundo. Two outs. Base is empty. Here's the catcher. Edmundo Benitez. Really good piece of hitting last time. Going to the opposite field. 
Pitch misses inside. Ball one. Well, he's so great about hitting the ball the other way. He gets those arms extended. So right there, just trying to straighten him up a little bit so he doesn't have as much outside plate coverage. The wind to kick the 2-0. This one lifted in the air. Left field. Little makes the catch, and that'll do it. Bottom of the six. Now here is Andreas Espinosa. For the missions, the third baseman, Andreas Espinosa. The wind of the pitch. And that one just misses a ball and no strikes. Fouled off. He was late. A little tardy on that fastball. He's going to have to get it going a little quicker. Get that front foot down. The pitch. That one hit to right. Phillies on the move to his left. Pulls it in on the run. And there's one away. The right fielder, number two, Matt Geringer. So digging in, Matt Geringer. Here comes a pitch. That's a strike across the top of the zone. Well, this guy on the mound's done a lot better than we would have expected, and the hitters just don't seem to have the right game plan. They're taking too many mistake pitches for called strikes. Kicks and fires. That's towards center. Guerra sizes this one up. That's out number two. A designated hitter, number five. Richard now it's the DH, Sanchez. Richard Sanchez. The wind of the pitch. And that one off the outside edge. Ball one, no strike. Starting to get some pretty good timing on that breaking ball, but he's going to have to stay ready for a fastball. Don't want to watch one go right by you. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. That's the third out. Back here at the ballpark. Now it's the second baseman, Antonio Acevedo. Springfield, the second baseman, Antonio Acevedo. Gets back to work. And a strike. And that one fouled off. The next offering misses, and the count is one and two. Stays alive. That misses. The count now two and two. Up the middle. And a base hit. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch. Just shot it through the infield. Now here is Cleveland Baker. First pitch just misses. Acevedo on at first. Nobody out. Lifted in the air, out to left. Little moving under it, and there's one down.
Now batting, left fielder, Mark Kane. The pitch. That's in for a strike. Next pitch is inside, and it's a ball to strike. And a count one and two. Out towards left center, Perez. On the move to his right, drops in for a hit, couldn't run it down. Acevedo coming home. Relay throw home. It's offline. The run comes in, and the lead is up to five. Now batting the right fielder. Javier. Now it's the switch hitting outfielder, Javier Feliz. The pitch. Ball nope. one, no strikes. Nope. One and oh. Next offering is in for a strike. Double barreled action in the bullpen. Parker Zimmerman up and loosening in the pen. Russo warming up as well. There's a strike. And the right-hander deals. This one in the air right field. Geringer drifts towards it. Hauls it in for the out. Now batting the third baseman. Jimmy Warner. Jimmy Warner, the next to hit. And he deals. That misses off the outside edge. Two outs and one in scoring position. Next offering misses, and the count is 2-0. He hasn't wanted to challenge him. Both of those pitches off the plate away. Don't expect anything down the heart of the plate. You may just have to be patient and take your walk here. In the air, out towards left center. Makes the catch, in and over. So they pick up a run on two hits. No errors and a man left. And welcome back. And now the center fielder, Billy Perez. Leading up for San Antonio, the center fielder, Billy Perez. And the right hater back to work. In the air, right field, Feliz under it. Brings it in. One away. The catcher, number 28, Scott. Stepping Love. in, Scott Love. And the pitch. Action in the pen down there. Carlos Murillo is loosening up. This would be his first appearance for the club. Justice getting loose as well. Swing and a miss. And a count even one and one. So impressive how the velo is still there even this deep into the outing. So a foul ball makes it one and two. And the next pitch is way outside. That hits the dirt. Full count now. Right through there. Got him. Two out. No, just couldn't pull the trigger on the fastball right there, and I don't think he was taking it, thinking it might be a called ball or anything. I just think he was flat out frozen. Did not expect that location, in my opinion. Haneda in the box for the third time today as he takes that one off the plate. Swing and a miss. And one and one. And one. 
Swings and misses. And the count one and two. Do that fastball right by him, slightly elevated. That's a confidence boost for this guy out there on the mound. See if he continues to climb the ladder. Acevedo makes the catch, and that'll do it. Welcome back. Ready to begin the eighth. And now, Garrett Garrett. The center fielder. Garrett. And here it comes. And first offering is fouled off. Right handed reliever. The swing and a soft liner. Pulls it down and he makes the catch. And there's one down. Now batting. The designated hitter, Marco. Ferreira. And now the DH, Marco Ferreira. The pitch. And that's downstairs and outside. Next offering is fouled back. Righty delivers. Check swing, but he went too far. And the count, one and two. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Right-hander kicks, deals. Well, he might have to look for a different put-away pitch right here, 2-2. Two, two. He's already seen the curveball a couple of times in this at-bat, so might have it timed up and ready for it. Next one misses, and the count's full. The other way. That's a hit. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Parker Zimmerman gets the ball now. Big deficit here, but he's still got a job to do. Number 33, Parker Zimmerman. Next to hit, Hiroki Yabu. First offering, and it just misses. And the righty deals. Out towards right center field. And that one hops the wall. Around third, Castilla with a relay throw. And the tag gets him. But a run does come in to score. The times that these guys take infield before ball games, they work on this play right here. And when it comes together perfectly, nice throw to the cutoff man, relay to third. You feel pretty good about cutting that guy off and keeping him from getting a triple. And... Getting it out. Digging in, Edmundo Benitez. And first offering is fouled off. Righty to the plate. Swings and misses. 0-2. Plenty of offense in this one, Singy. I guess you'd say kind of what we expected, though. Well, this was a game looking at the pitching matchup where you expected offense to score ah that ends the inning so we take a break bottom of the eighth here's a speed threat carlton little leading up for san antonio the left fielder carl the pitch little Aye. left hand hitter waits and ball one. And a count one and two. Next pitch is in the dirt. Two and two. Next one off the plate inside. Three and two now.
And there's ball four. Oh, looking for a swing and miss right there or for the ump to help him out and make a call with that last pitch, but neither happened. Close pitch, but a good take to earn that walk. Manager out of the dugout now, and it looks like we'll see a change on the mound. Number 13 is done, and as he heads for the dugout, we'll take a quick break. New arm on the mound when we get back. Well, the leadoff man gets on. You want to minimize the threat by playing sound defense. Hopefully the pitcher can get a ball on the ground and they can roll him up for two. Castilla stands in here, leaves that one down. So, a foul ball makes it one and two. And meanwhile, that pitch is off the catcher's mitt. It squirts away. And now, a man into scoring position. Kicks and deals. And now it's filled up. Little. Leads off second with nobody out. Taps softly to the right side. The flip to the pitcher covering. One gone to the bottom of the eighth. The batter, the first baseman, Joaquin Ryan. And now the first baseman, Joaquin Ryan. And this is a big opportunity for him to pick up his teammate right here. And a pitch. There's a strike. Movement in the bullpen. Luther Larkin preparing to come on if needed. Justice getting cranked up as well. And a pitch. That's out to center field. Guerra racing over to make the catch. In comes the runner from third. It's 6-1. The third baseman, number six, Andreas. Espinosa. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Andreas Espinosa, for the fourth time tonight. The wind of the pitch. That missed inside. Swing and a miss. And a count one and one. Got him. Inning over. Top of the ninth. Here's the second baseman, Antonio Acevedo. Leading off for Springfield. A wind in the pitch. Antonio Acevedo. That clips the corner. In the air, left field, Little. Settles underneath it. Makes the catch for the out. Now batting. The shortstop. Cleveland. Baker. So the batting order turns over. And now it's going to be Cleveland Baker. The pitch. Oh. And that skips into dirt. Swing and a miss, and he was fooled. Clearly all in on the fastball right there, but it was a changeup. Bottom just fell out of it. He's going to have to make an adjustment. Next pitch inside. Two balls and a strike. Boog, he never moved because he never had time to. But that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. The next pitch misses, and the count is three and one. And that's ball four. Now batting. The left field. Mark. Game. Here comes a pitch. That's inside. Meanwhile, activity in the bullpen. Antonio De Jesus getting ready to go. Russo warming up as well. 
A swing and a miss, and that's strike one. Baker stands at first with one out. At the belt and fires. Stays alive. Next pitch in the dirt, and the count is two and two. Two two now. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Now two away. Javier Feliz digs in now. Now batter, the right fielder. The pitch. Oh, yeah. oh, Good eye right there. Kicks and fires. And now two and nothing. Oh, he's really working him away this at bat. Sometimes take a little bit off velocity. Try to get a rollover, something on the ground. Stay away from that big hole on the right side of the infield. Next one is off the plate. Three and oh. Backdoor breaking ball just missed right there. And boy, umpire didn't give him the call. I bet you if he throws it again, hitter knows he's gonna have to swing it. And ball four to a board. Now batter, third baseman, Jimmy Warner. Now time is called here. Pitching coach on his way out to the mound. Yeah, the right hander back to work. Warner in the box here. Let's that one go for a ball. Two outs, a couple of base runners at first and second. Next pitch misses, 2 and 0. Oh. Could be some action here on this next pitch. Couple runners on, probably a challenge pitch coming. Slapped foul. Swings and misses. That's out number three. <laughs> Bottom of the night. And the batter now, Matt Geringer. Leading off for the missions, the right fielder, Matt Geringer. And a pitch. There's a strike. Next offering upstairs. The 1-1 one, one is cut on and missed in a pitch upstairs. Next one just misses. And that's ball two. That to right. Believes. Glides back. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. One up, one down. A designated hitter, number five. And Richard. next is the designated hitter, Sanchez. Richard Sanchez. And he deals. Ball one. And there's a ball. Count one and oh. Just missed. And now two and one. Well, he came right at it right there, challenged him with the 2-0 fastball. Not sure exactly what he was looking for, but gotta imagine that's a confidence booster on the mound. You're in that hitter's head a little bit. And the pitch. 
Swing and a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Now that is Billy Perez getting ready to hit. The right-hander back to work. And now just two outs away. Sanchez, the base runner at first with one out. Next offering is in for a strike. Next one misses. Now one and two. Too close for me, partner, to take that 0-2 fastball, but for whatever reasons, he let it go by. He's still in the at-bat. I don't think he'll let the next one go. Two two now. Got him looking, and he's down on strikes for the second time today. And at first, and now the catcher comes up to him. Scott Lowe, one for three. The pitch, just off the inside edge. And it's fouled away. Here's a 1 1. Pitch misses, and that's ball three. Three two, two out, runner on first. A lot of movement in the infield. Hitters got to stay focused on the pitch. 3-2. Out to center. Guerra on the move. And that'll do it. What an exciting finish to this game. An amazing play right there. It's hard for the fans to go home. They want more. They're not ready to leave and head to their cars. But an outstanding job to keep entertaining all the way to the end. 6-1 is your final here today. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chambi. Talk to you soon. The final line score for our ball game.